hi hello this is balaji welcome back to the channel so today i have a question which is not an sql question but a case study what is a case study uh, case studies are frequently asked questions in interviews where you are given a situation and you are expected to think through the answer so they do not expect a proper right answer or a wrong answer but it's about how you think through the question so let's try solving this case study this was asked to me at a product round at grid so i'll show you the question so it says consider yourself as an analyst working at netflix the data science team has deployed a new recommendation model that is claimed to be much more efficient than the existing one the model recommends 10 movies or tv series at once so they reach out to you 3 months after deploying the model asking how it has performed so how would you go about working on this problem what are the metrics you would be considering to check the model's performance what are the check metrics that is the metrics or the criteria that determine if the product is doing as expected what are the kill metrics uh, these are the criteria that de- determine whether an otherwise promising project should be ended say for example you are running a project for a few months uh you will have to know when to end the project project so that you do not burn more than expected so these are called the kill metrics and check metrics are the metrics that which tell you if the metric uh, if the feature that is rolled out is working properly as expected or not so you can pause the video here and try it on your own and uh, then you can come back to the video and i will give you the solution that i have thought of yeah so moving on to the solution uh yes first let's understand the steps taken by the user so what does the user do the user first searches for the netflix website lands at the login page and signs in or sign up and lands the home page of the netflix uh right so here is how the netflix home page looks like here so what you see here is the recent movies or tv series that's rolled out and in the bottom is the recommendation so these are the recommended movies or tv series and uh, going by the question there are 10 of them so if you can if you consider this as index number 1 this is 1 2 3 4 5 so on and so forth so let's move on to how i'm going to solve the problem right okay these are the check metrics which have a direct impact so first one would be if any of these recommendations are clicked essentially the click through rate so what is click through rate so if you come back here if the user logs in and clicks on any of the recommendation it is considered as one click and number of times this click happens on a given video or a link or anything is a click through rate so this essentially gives us uh, evidence that this recommendation has been clicked by the user when will the user click the recommendation when it impacts him that is if the user looks at the recommendation and says uh, and thinks it is worthy of looking into and clicks on that so that's the first check now second check what i think would be is how evenly have these recommendations have been clicked so going back here so given there are multiple recommendations so all of these should be worked out well by the model so it cannot be that only two of them are personalized and the rest of them are incorrect recommendations so this also gives us how well the model is working so this is the second one which index has been clicked higher so let's go back here considering uh, this video as index number 1 this is 2 this is 3 4 5 and up until 10 so if the index number 1 has been clicked more than the index number 2 it means the ranking of the personalization has been done right let's take a case here the index number 9 of the list of videos has been clicked higher than the rest of them this means that the personal personalization of the model 
has not been done so right that the customer or the user s- seems to be liking the end uh, recommendations and the top priority recommendations so this could tell us that the recommendation engine has not recommended it right or ranked it right for the user so going to the next one after clicking on a recommendation how much percentage of the movie has been watched or how many episodes have been binged so once the user clicks on a episode or clicks on a movie if the user likes the movie he or she will watch the entire movie and go on to look into the other movies in the recommendations or if it is a tv series the user will look uh, watch the first pilot episode and if he or she likes it he or she will start binging the other episodes and eventually the other seasons of the tv series this essentially shows how likable the recommendation is in case the user does not like the recommendation he or she will drop off from the movie or the tv series say if the user watches the movie for about 15 minutes he uh, he or she doesn't like the movie they going to drop off this essentially shows uh, that the recommendation has not worked out really well how many of these recommendations have been watched this is check number 5 so going back so we have 10 recommendations but if only two of them have a good click through rate but the rest of them do not have a good good click through rate but have been disliked by the user it means that the user the personalization has not been done right which also tells us that the recommendation engine has not done its work rightly now likes and super likes every video has a like or a super like if this has been clicked it essentially shows that the video is liked by the customer the user so these are the direct impacted metrics indirectly impacting metrics are the next ones now uh we can look at the idle time of the user versus the watch hours of the user for the given session so say for example a user logs into the account stays on the account for 2 hours and logs out of the account so this will be considered as one session so in this is the i if the customer the user has been scrolling through for about 1 hour of the session and has watched only for the rest one hour it does not mean that the recommendation has been done right the confusion state of the user essentially shows that the recommendation did not work for the user so that leaves us to scrolling so if the customer is totally confused of what to watch then the scrolling activity increases so the more the scrolling activity of the user is it means it's directly proportional to the confusion state of the user which means the recommendation of the algorithm to the user has not worked right now ctr of the recommended tv shows versus non recommended tv shows or the movies so say for example these are the recommended movies and these are the not recommended movies so if the not recommended not recommended movies are watched higher or ctr of the not recommended movies are higher than the recommended movies or tv series it essentially shows us that the non recommended ones are doing better than the recommended ones so that's the customer the user will scroll down and watch his or her own uh, tv series or movies that they want to watch than the recommended ones so this will tell us if the recommendation has worked right or not this is a indirect impact now is a kill metrics kill metrics are essentially those metrics which have to be monitored closely to see if the feature is going on the right path or not this should be the search rate so what is the search rate of the users say if the recommendation engine is not recommending properly then the user is going to go to the search bar and search for his or her wish of movie so this essentially shows the recommendation is useless and the user depends on the search box than the recommendation and every video has a dislike button and the dislike is means that the the, uh, the video or the movie or the tv series is not liked and if the dislike is higher in the re- 
recommended movies or TV series than the non-recommended ones, it shows us that this recommendation has not worked. Then daily active users retention. So in the first of the month, if you have had like thousand users watching the movies and TV series, and by the end of the month, you have barely, uh, say maybe eighty to seventy percent of the users only watching it. It means the users have not been caught on by the recommendations, and given the recommendations have not been great, the user drop has happened. So these are the check metrics and kill metrics that we would be looking into. So, if there are any other check metrics or kill metrics that you think I missed out, please do comment in the comment section. Thank you.